Hi, I'm Nisha. I'm mom to 14. We have 12 children still at home, ages 21 down to the baby is four months. And so I'm going to do a grocery haul for you because I get asked so many questions so often about what we eat and how we eat and that type of stuff. Right now we're doing paleo. Um, so there'll be no um, extras. We basically eat meat, seafood, vegetables, fruits, nuts, and oils. But we do that like 90% of the time and we give ourselves grace and allow 10% of the time just sometimes to have some treats or messes up or can't find that at the store or whatever it might be. So it's my first grocery haul, so bear with me. Okay, so we have the organic ketchup. And we got four of those. I do make some of our homemade ketchup, um, which we'll mix in things, but then we also buy some. And then these minis guacamole is great when we're um, going somewhere. We use a lot of coconut oil. They have a really good price at Sam's. This is all from Sam's Club. Um, the almond milk here, the unsweetened we get. And I got, let's see, two, four, six, eight, ten of those. Um, rice cauliflower was a really good price. I think it was only like six fifty eight, I believe. Um, the coffee, have to have coffee here. I got a dozen creamers. Um, we try to use almond creamer, but have not been able to get almond creamers. They had nothing there. So I just got some half and half there to go in coffee for the people who have cream in their coffee. Um, almond butter is a great price at Sam's Club. I can't remember it for sure what it is, but I know it's a really good price. Um, we needed some garlic and then we grow most of our own meat, um, but we're running low in the meat department. We didn't grow chickens this year. Um, we just used some old laying hens that we had. So I was looking to do a recipe with some chicken breast. So I just bought two packages of chicken breast because we don't just have the breasts anymore. We have thighs and um, such. So I got these two packages, which will be one meal for our family. We also ran out of hamburger, um, which is only temporary because we'll be butchering some cows as soon as it gets cool enough. Um, so I just bought some hamburger. This was a really good price. It's three pounds for 16 or three pounds, a little over three pounds for 16.48 and that's grass fed organic. Um, so that's good. I've never bought in salmon to be honest with you, but we're trying to eat more salmon. Um, for the health benefits of it. And this is wild caught salmon. It's really expensive. I think we're just gonna have this once a month and try it out. I bought some beef patties here and those are gonna go to church cause we um, grill after church and we'll just throw those on the grill there. Um, this here, I'm gonna add into smoothies and possibly I had a couple recipes I wanted to try that actually called for that out of the Trim Healthy Mama book. Um, so I'm gonna try those. I got two of the stir-fry veggies like this, and then I got two of the broccoli Normandy, a case of bananas. Um, we do tons with bananas. We like to dehydrate them. We like to throw them in the freezer to add to smoothies. We like to throw them in the freezer to make ice cream. Um, we go through a lot of bananas. Here is some mixed fruit. We do um, forage and grow some of our own berries. Um, so all those are in the freezer, but I just picked that up to kind of supplement. Um, I got ham and chicken breast. These are mainly for my husband or for going somewhere to kind of roll up and um, cause we're not eating bread. So we'll just roll those up and maybe have like some veggies or something in between in inside of it. So we'd have like cucumbers or um, pickles or something like rolled up in it and then eat it like that. Um, then we have two cases here of the pears, three bags of avocados, some dried mango, sliced almonds. These are really good on top of salads. I love doing almonds 
And then um, cranberries on top of salads. So it's really good. Especially when you run out of fresh fruits and vegetables. Um, our cucumbers just finished for the season. So I just grabbed two bags of cucumbers. Yep, they almost down there. Um, and then mangoes were a good price. They were under a dollar a piece. Two bags of nectarines, which were under $2 a pound. The peppers, we'll slice those up and eat those. Um, limes, I want to freeze some of the limes, um, some of the juice from the limes to add to recipes. And then we have um, the carrots. A bunch of those are just going to get like into carrot sticks so that we can pull them out whenever we need an extra vegetable. I got two of these. I, we're growing a lot of our own stuff, but I thought that this would be good just if for quick and easy if we were making like um, taco bowls or whatever that I'd already have it um, prepared if it was one of those nights that it was just trying to throw it together quick. Um, half and half salad, two of those. Then I have a watermelon and four cantaloupes. I'll use the watermelon, two cantaloupes, and two of these grapes back here to make fruit salad for the week. Um, we have four of these, these 18 packs, no, two dozens. So four of the two dozens of the eggs. I'll probably take one of these and just do hard boiled eggs and then use the rest either in breakfast or whatever. These right here are good for on the go or if like my husband wants to take these um, to go to work with. Um, this organic ginger was a great price. And we have dates. Um, we're making quite a few snacks with dates. And we use quite a bit with it. And plums. Grapes. I have some almond flour already or else I'd need to buy more. I just bought one almond flour. And then these for a snack. So now we have a bunch of bunch of chips. <laughs> So normally I would not buy all of these. Um, I bought all of these because they were on clearance for $1.51, I believe it was. They were super cheap, so I figured that I would stock them. They don't have soy, which is huge. A lot of times they have soybean oil in them. Um, and they don't have the corn. So yay for that. So I got a bunch of those for cheap, but these were what were actually on my list so these we'll use almost as you would like a, a corn um, taco or like a two taco bowls or something like that um, and then this is usually what we would bring if we were going someplace like um, just a quick and easy snack we can also bring like a bag of that to church to share with everyone um, during our Sunday after meal because it's like safe for us to have okay and then i just got a couple things that um here that are like non-food items so toilet paper is always cheapest at um sam's trash bags i love these things they don't rip i treated myself to some tulips i love tulips and they're really usually so expensive and they were fairly inexpensive. I think this was like $18 for 50 bulbs. But I treated myself. And then I got these paper plates for a church. So that is all. Um, the grand total for everything was, I think it was $1,052. So yeah, I think that we did okay. And this should take us pretty much through the month. I'll do about $200 um, in about two weeks on just fresh fruits and vegetables. And I'll try to post once a week on maybe some meals that we did to give you an idea if you're looking for that. Okay, thanks so much, bye-bye.